are just hoping that they will make one discovery out there that will put them on the map. Well, a 14-year-old amateur astronomer from upstate New York has done just that. Using a small telescope, Caroline Moore discovered a supernova. See, you can see it as plain as the nose on your face, right? <laughs> it's an exploding star in a galaxy that is, get this, 70 million light years away. It's also no. an extremely rare supernova, and Caroline is now the youngest person in the world to discover her own supernova. I love the word supernova. She's here to talk to us about the big discovery. Hey, Caroline. Hi. So you're just finishing ninth grade. Yes. Right? And mm -hmm. how did you find this? Um, well, I actually got asked to join a supernova search team, uh, the Pocket Supernova Search Team. Are there a lot of 14-year-olds on the supernova search team? <laughs> no. No? <laughs> I'm the youngest. They're all... Your dad got you into this. Yeah, yeah. Well, my dad, we got our first telescope when I was 10. Right. And so that's that's kind of how we got started and we started That's joining nice. clubs and things like that. Hey, yeah. put, put this up on the screen, the supernova, and tell us you're looking at your computer, Caroline, and you spot this thing. And I mean, to me, it looks like, a, you know, you're like stars. So put it up. There it is. And, and how do you figure out, you know, that's that's an oddity right there. Well, you know, the interesting thing is the actual discovery image I was looking at was a lot harder to see than that. It was all snowy and looked like, you know, a winter blizzard, but wow. um, it was it was pretty small. It was pretty dim. It was an amazing find. But what, what caught your eye when you're looking at, you know, a much more dense picture than this? Well, what I get is I also get an old picture, and right. I'm looking to see if there's a anything difference. new in the picture. So that wasn't there. And, and this supernova is 25 times the size of the sun. Yes. Pretty bright. Hard to wrap wow. your brain around. When yeah, you told for your me dad, to wrap my brain when you said, Dad, Dad, I found a supernova. He's like, Are you, are you kidding me? Yeah, he said, yeah. Go to sleep. Get back to your homework. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Well, he's on the search team with me, too. So he's been looking. I think he's found two. So. Do you want to be a professional? Um, you know, I love science. I have lots yeah. of interest in science, even since right. I'm really little. So. How about an astronaut? And, Oh, that would be cool. That, that would be, be cool. cool. <laughs> you take Martha with you because yeah, I will go. go. Absolutely. Thank <laughs> you, Caroline. Great, Thank you so much. Great. Good, Good luck, luck to you. Great stuff. Thanks Thank for you. coming in. Thank you. Well, obesity is a leading cause for so many.